What's up guys, Vic Dixit here again, Strikers Reptiles, and today we're just going to be showing you a little bit of our Savannah Monitor setup. All right, she's in a 7x3 foot cage, and I just wanted to show you guys some stuff about basking and Savannah Monitors. So here we've got our basking stack. I guess this is called a Retis stack. Sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. And there's our girl. She's basking. So we want to keep that hot spot, which is right here, at 125 to 140 degrees for 12 hours a day. Now, you hear a lot of people saying that, you know, savanna monitors are lazy, savanna monitors are lethargic. She looks so offended. You know, they're, uh, they say they're an inactive, lazy species, and while that is true to an extent, I think a lot of that commonly held belief comes from people who keep them at low basking temperatures. I'm going to show you guys something in a minute that uh, will make you see this animal as anything but lethargic. Right, so right now she's basking, she's got two bulbs above her, uh, one is a 50 watt and one is a 60 watt I believe. and here in Florida, being warm most of the year, that's all it takes to keep her hot spot around 135 degrees. So, with that, I'm going to show you guys something. Alright guys, about to show you how lazy our Savannah Monitor is. Yeah, so when people say that this is a lethargic species, these are vicious hunters. Don't worry, the rats are already dead. These are vicious hunters. They are highly food motivated. And uh, when they get the opportunity to eat, they're anything but lethargic. So just to recap here, guys. Savannah monitors need their basking temperatures well into the 120s to, uh, just to aid in proper digestion as well as to uh, you know keep their kidneys functioning properly. Most husbandry related issues you see with savannah monitors is all related to uh, you know low temperatures and low humidity. You know this is her being lazy after a big meal, but uh, even now she's curious. You know if I put my hands by her, she'll start flicking her tongue and stuff. She'll let me pet her this because she's really nice we'll do another video on how to get them nice and tame like her but uh yeah guys if you like this video please drop a like feel free to subscribe this is our second video just starting out so we'll really appreciate the support and uh have a great day thank you